say goodbye to frustrating Wi-Fi dead zones with your new Eero devices. Let's get you set up. Before we begin, you'll need a working UW broadband signal. If you need to set up your router, type this link into your search bar or scan this QR code to get connected. In the box we sent you, you'll find your Eero devices, Eero power supply, and an Ethernet cable. Outside the box, you'll need a smart mobile device connected to the internet with the Eero app. Download it from the Google Play or Apple App Store. Next, you'll need to set up a new account in the Eero app. Simply open up the app and follow the on-screen instructions. Once you've set up an account, you'll need to set up your gateway. Your gateway is the primary Eero device needed to establish your network, which will need to stay connected to your router at all times. You can use any Eero device as the gateway. The app will ask you to unplug your router from its power socket. If you have other wireless equipment connected to your router, please unplug it as well. If you have an ONT box, you don't need to unplug this. Simply leave it as it is. Connect your Gateway Eero device to your router using the yellow Ethernet cable. Plug one end into one of the yellow Ethernet ports on your router, then plug the other end into either of the Ethernet ports in the back of your Gateway Eero. Next, plug your Gateway Eero device into an available power outlet, then also reconnect your router back to power. Your Eero device's status light will start flashing white. Once you've set up your gateway, press Next on the app. Your gateway will start looking for your Eero device, with your Eero then flashing blue, then turn a solid blue once found. Once your Eero device has been found, select a location for your Eero device. You'll then be asked to input your Wi-Fi network name and password. It's important you use your UW Wi-Fi username and password so your devices connect automatically. Now tap Next on the app to complete the setup of your network. Finally, you can now switch off your router's Wi-Fi by pressing the Wi-Fi button on the router for at least two seconds. This will ensure only one Wi-Fi network shows up. You can now add additional Eero devices to extend your network. Simply choose Add Another Eero in the app and follow the on-screen instructions. Here are some placement tips for your Eero network. If you have a Wi-Fi dead spot in your home, place your new Eero device between the dead spot and another Eero to ensure a strong connection. The app will tell you if it's in a good place or not. Keep it out in the open for the best signal. Don't lock it away under the stairs or in a cupboard. And definitely keep them out of the kitchen and away from electronic appliances like microwaves, wireless speakers, baby monitors, and cordless phones. Even a fish tank can slow down your Wi-Fi. And that's it. You should now be all set up and ready to enjoy UW Broadband with zero dead zones.